All right, guys, day two, starting off. Most mornings look just like this. A couple Takatis, sunscreen, and a beautiful sunrise. I thought I had fixed the mic situation on day one, but um, turns out day two is just as bad. So I'm gonna do a little voiceover on this one. Day three, I know for sure has uh, audio, so. All right, so for our day two game plan, um, we're gonna start off fishing Cabrilla on one of the uh, local islands. Um, it was steady, but not wide open. Pretty much the whole trip was about like this, a lot of casting for a couple fish, but um, we just kind of wanted to run down the island, assess the wind situation, and if it was nice, we were gonna make our uh, way out to the bigger island for some bigger yellowtail and uh, possibly grouper or other species. A lot of these cabria that we were catching, we were catching on the Yozuri Hydro Minnow in the 170 size. Uh, and uh, Jordan was fishing the Mad Scat again, but uh, he was not having as much luck this day. So about halfway to the big island, we decided to check out some high spots and see if there's any yellowtail holding, but for the most part, all we caught were some very big bonito. So we decided to uh, keep pushing onward and check out the big island. Now this high spot was such a trip, the current was ripping so gnarly, so we would only get about one to two drops before we'd have to wind back up and get back on it. So it was a very small spot, but it was definitely jugged. Unfortunately, I did not get the bite on this bigger yellowtail. I was, again, trying to keep the GoPro out of the way for Matt while he was filming, but this is about a quarter of the way through or halfway through the fight here. It was a big one, got it off the bottom. It was taking a lot of line at first, and then it, it was coming up pretty good, and then um, shot back down, and it was a pretty good fight. I had actually put the reel in low gear just to test out that Torx performance, but yeah, it was sick. felt really good to pull on a really nice yellowtail again. It's been a while. Um, 
those local home guards back home have been kind of swerving me. So it was nice to pull on a big fish again. So this particular fish I actually didn't get jigging. Um, I hung up on the bottom and I was like stuck so I popped it out and I took like three cranks and then that fish hit it and I thought for a second I was stuck on the bottom again but um, eventually felt those head shakes and knew it was a fish so pretty sick. I was super stoked on this fish. Nothing super large um, but it was probably 25 to 30 pounds so definitely highlight of the trip as far as big fish goes for me. After watching Joel pick up the jigging stick, I decided to try it out myself and caught a couple bonito, a couple small yellowtail. So once I picked up this jigging stick, it, I was kind of blown away. It's way easier to jig using that shorter rod and it definitely gives the jig way more action. And uh, for those wondering, this jigging rod is a Phoenix Megalodon rated PE 326. So it's a 30 to 60 pound jigging rod with a pen fathom 15 extra narrow, I believe. Or a pen fathom 25 narrow two speed lever jack. One of those, I can't remember. Out of all the jiggy rods we used this trip, I think the Phoenix Megalodon was definitely the most comfortable and fun to fish. Um, you'll see some of the Shimano stuff that we actually fished on day three, but those things were just out of this world and crazy bendy, but Phoenix Megalodon had the best action in my opinion. So this one, we reset the drift. Um, almost immediately, I think Jordan had a big bite on the dropper loop and he missed it. Um, I think he had, he had quite a few bites on the dropper loop and some of them like just didn't get the hook or were on for like half a second and fell off. I don't know, it was weird, but I think that's what happened here. And then I started winding up and uh, I got a nice bite. It was probably another fish in that 20 to 30 pound range just by how I was taking line, but ultimately broke me off. And for the last fish of the day, Jordan got a nice big bite on the uh, drop a loop mackerel to round out our day before we take off. Thank you.